Another option in the struggle to move Nashville forward while fighting traffic. Golf carts are now officially recognized as a way to move people around town. New at 6, not everyone is excited about adding more golf carts to busy city roads. Our Rebecca Schleicher joins us from downtown. Rebecca, cab drivers are some of the loudest voices to object. Vicki, you can't come downtown without seeing cab drivers just about everywhere. Now, lately, golf carts as well. The cab drivers say the golf cart drivers threaten both their safety and their business. Metro Council approved regulations for them back in January and today officially recognized them licensing four different companies. No. All right. There we go. Not just for the golf course anymore. To drive anything on wheels is secondhand nature to me. You know, we just go around, we get to meet people and show people a good time around town. Lacey Day drives a golf cart for Joyride. Put your seatbelts on, ticket. Back on that. We're back on that. She doesn't charge, just accepts tips. She says the upsides to carting around town are obvious. You know, you got the wind in your hair, you know, a friendly driver. Kind of nice to have someone friendly to talk to. When we're doing 25 miles an hour, we've got a lot of control to react to anything that might happen around us. Thursday, the city officially put low speed vehicles on the books. We kind of feel like it's just going to work itself out. Regulating them just as they do taxis and limos with insurance and inspection. Don't do anything illegal. You are the we are all about safety. But cab drivers protest that golf carts aren't safe. How would you feel about riding in a vehicle as a cab without doors? They say in just two years, their business has been cut in half. Now, life is really hard for us. It's not like before. It's a pie. You've got slices. Ever since companies like Joyride and Uber came to town. It's just so much to go around. So certainly it affects the livelihood of a family whose major breadwinner is a driver. He's an owner operator. He's a small business person. Carts can operate on any street, 35 miles an hour or less. Germantown, 12 South, the Gulch. East Nashville. And despite the protests, it's dangerous. With no serious incidents yet, no goal for car. and their new legitimacy, you may see more of them. I think this is the future of Nashville. Leaving cab drivers spinning their wheels. And if it's safe to pull over and pick you up, we're right there immediately. Under the new regulations, the low speed vehicles have to have seat belts, headlights, turn signals, brakes, special training and insurance. And these companies who were approved today will have their drivers re-up their certificate every year. Reporting live downtown, Rebecca Schleicher, News Channel 5 HD. All right, thanks so much, Rebecca.